Right then, away from uh, aviation matters, let's move into agriculture. Participants attending an agricultural forum in Ethiopia's capital are set to introduce an investment plan for the Horn of Africa. The UN's Food and Agriculture Organization estimates that about 70 million people in the region suffer from chronic food shortages caused by drought and famine. Now, IGAD, in collaboration with the African Union and the FAO, is expected to officially launch the strategy at these meetings. The plan will complement the comprehensive African Agriculture Development Plan. We think that uh, uh, by uh, adopting uh, really uh, the regional, uh, uh, the regional uh, invest agricultural investment plan, which will complement what the countries do, the agricultural uh, uh, development uh, will be enhancing. So all these activities together will uh, enhance the, uh, the, 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 the food security and uh, resilience capacity of the communities, especially the vulnerable groups. And this also will contribute into overall economic and the social development uh, of uh, the whole region of the Horn of Africa. This is a consultative meeting. It's the third in a series of uh, consultations we are doing with the sub-region to develop the EGAD Regional Agricultural Investment Plan. Why do we need a regional investment plan when countries have their own investment plans? One, it's because among this sub-region, as I mentioned, the issue of, 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 of investment is common, low investment in agriculture, so low productivity. Second, the trade between the member states is also very low, so you cannot, you cannot even promote value addition. Again, value addition to products is very, very, very low. The issue of science and technology is also hampered. So what we are expecting, that the member states that are gathered here together today, the senior officers, will look at the document and do corrections to the document because this is a technical document that they own. They will correct it and make sure that what is in the document aligns with the regional priorities.